Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Ozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. Today's topic is the muscles on the lateral aspect of the lower leg, the peroneus longus and the peroneus brevis. In order to understand these muscles a little bit better, you have to know about the fibular bone, which is the long slender bone located on the lateral aspect of the lower leg. The head of the fibula is up here at the proximal aspect and the lateral malleolus is at the distal aspect of the fibula. The two muscles, the peroneus longus and the peroneus brevis, originate on the lateral aspect of the fibula. The peroneus longus originates up here at the proximal aspect of the fibula and it runs inferior, it goes posterior and inferior to the lateral malleolus goes to the bottom of the foot and attaches to two bones on the plantar aspect of the foot, the first metatarsal bone and the medial cuneiform bone. Its actions, its concentric action is eversion and plantar flexion of the ankle, and it is innervated by the superficial perineal nerve, which is also known as the superficial fibular nerve. The peroneus brevis originates in the lower aspect of the fibula. Its tendon also runs inferior and goes posterior and inferior to the lateral malleolus. It also goes to the bottom part of the foot, which is called the plantar aspect of the foot, and it attaches to the plantar aspect of the bone called the fifth metatarsal. Its action is also eversion and plantar flexion, so these muscles work together, and it is also innervated by the superficial perineal nerve.